Hello friends, today I'm going to talk about Graves disease. Graves disease is an autoimmune disease which is mediated by stimulating antibodies. I have mentioned the entire concept of stimulating antibodies in my previous video. I'll try to link it down somewhere. So this is the diagrammatic representation of Graves disease. Pituitary gland releases thyroid stimulating hormone which stimulates the production of thyroid hormones. This TSH will bind to thyroid stimulating hormone receptor which is present on thyroid cells. This results in activating adenylate cyclase which will further produce thyroid hormones. There are two thyroid hormones. The first one is thyroxine and the second one is triiodothyronine. Now this was in a normal person. If the person is suffering from Graves disease, we have a thyroid cell, thyroid stimulating receptors also, but those autoantibodies are like agonist. it will mimic the function of thyroid stimulating hormone. It will also produce thyroid hormones, but the only difference is, in this case, there is no negative feedback. So the body keeps on producing it. There is no limit to the production, thus unregulated production of thyroid hormones. Here, when thyroid hormone is sufficient for a person it will give a negative feedback to the pituitary gland asking it to stop the production of thyroid stimulating hormone so that is the basic difference these antibodies overstimulate the thyroid thus these antibodies are known as lats long acting thyroid stimulating antibodies so these antibodies have a specific name that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching do share and subscribe bye bye